All right, here's the old 84 Venture Royale. Um, changing oil in the forks. Uh, it's pretty nasty and muddy in there. This bike has been parked for, well, the records I could find indicate at least 12, perhaps even as much as 15 years. So we got everything else working, runs like a charm. Um, now I'm changing out the fork oil. <clears throat> this one has the air, air ride system on it. So I was looking for a way to put oil back in the top of the forks. And there really is no easy way. You have to take everything apart to do that. So I decided instead, come down here. <clears throat> you drain the fork oil out here. This little bolt, pull that bolt out and oil will come out. And then to put oil back in, I decided just push, push it in the way it came out. So what I've done is I've got a measure, measuring cup, measured out my 400 mils or 400 cc's. <clears throat> Grabbed a little pump, little hand pump. Took the bolt out, drained all the oil. Now, because there's going to be air pressure as you push oil back in, I came back here to the air compressor. I loosened the air line for the front. Basically, yeah, just basically loosen that so there's no air pressure whatsoever in there. Come back here, grab the oiler, pump her up and put in the full 400 mils and put the bolt back in. So that's basically it, simple as that. Now I'm gonna come over, do the same thing on the other side. Set up the pan, drain the oil, measure out 400 cc's, pump it back in. When I'm all done that, I will go back to the air compressor Retighten this up, maybe add a little bit of lubrication oil to the compressor, just so it, well, it's probably dry, but yeah. Anyway, it works. We'll just put some lubrication in there. And that should be it for changing fork oil. Everything else I looked into on this bike said you have to take the forks out and basically do a fork rebuild. I'm not interested in that. I just want to change the oil. Um, and then other places that I found said, okay, now you gotta take all of this apart and get into here and then pull the rubber cap off and then pull the, uh, the screw in cap out and there's all kinds of stuff behind there. Again, don't, I don't wanna disturb anything on this old bike. <laughs> the less I touch, the better. <clears throat> so drain the oil out of the little hole, push the oil back in the little hole, and I'm done.